Cause I've gotta be the best I can be Yes, reaching Running faster, learning more But after each goal is met I know there's something better yet And I'm still waiting for something Searching for something Reaching for something that's not Well, big day today, Bobby. Are you all ready? Mom, I've decided not to try out for the school talent show. Nonsense, Bobby. You do very well. And now we've just bought you that new guitar. But, Mom... Bobby, you never know what you can do unless you try. And even if you don't get to perform on the show, at least you'll have had the experience of trying out. I think you'll surprise yourself. I'll be late getting home. The tryouts are after school. Okay. Do your best. Good luck. Excellent, Karen. That was excellent. Next is uh, Bobby Johnson. Well, here goes. to put him out of his what misery. <laughs> love can see. Look at what you've done. You've dried my tears. you brought the sun. <laughs> this warmth you bring. It colors All right, you guys. Knock it off. And I've <laughs> got a <laughs> Mr. Reed, there's long distance coffee in the office. Uh, get the name and number and tell them I'll call them back later. Uh, should I start over? No, that won't be necessary. Should I just keep going on from where I am? No, that's enough for today. Sure is. <laughs> Let's see, uh, who's next? I hope it's better than that last kid. <laughs> it could be worse. <laughs> Is Stephanie Andrus here yet? Oh, Stephanie Andrus? Have Squeaky sing another song. Oh, no, not Squeaky. Not Squeaky. <laughs> Let's take a 10 minute break and then start with Stephanie Andrus. Poor kid. It's his own fault. Some people shouldn't even try out. 
I wish I'd never let Mom talk me into this. By tomorrow, I'll be the laughing stock of the whole school. Mm, poor guy. He must be embarrassed to death. If I had more time, I'd see if I could cheer him up a bit. But I've got to get that biology done. Say, did you see a guy carrying a guitar case go by this way? Yeah, he went in there. Thanks. Pretty rough in there, wasn't it? Yeah. I really thought you did all right. Sure, I was just great. Well, those high notes are tough to hit. But I really like your guitar playing. There was nothing wrong with that. I play the guitar a little. What kind of finger picking did you use in that introduction? Uh, nothing much. Just something I made up. Say, I've got an idea. I'll give you a ride home, and we'll stop by my house on the way. And you can show me that introduction. It won't take very long. I don't know. Aw, oh, come on. I'd really appreciate it. Well, OK. Pretty nice car. Thanks. Is it yours? Yeah. Hi, Mother. This is Bobby Johnson. Nice to meet you, Bobby. Nice to meet you. You sure got a nice house. Thank you. You must play the guitar. Well, a little. Don't let him fool you. He plays very well. And he's come over to teach me a few things. Uh, say, do we have anything to eat? I'm sure I can find something. You two go ahead, and I'll bring it to you. Oh, that'd be great. Thanks. Now, show me how you played that introduction. You start again, just a little bit slower. Okay, let me try it a few times. Sounds pretty good. Ready to break for a sandwich? Sure. How's this? Looks great. That was really nice of your mother. Let me try it again. Great, you've got it. What type of music do you like to play? Uh, some bluegrass, some classical. I like most kinds. Do you have a few more minutes? Yeah. Well, how about a quick jam session? Sure, that'd be great.
Thanks for the help, Bobby. And remember, next Wednesday after school, I'll practice a little more so I can keep up with you. I'll remember. And thanks. It's been great. be in the show, but you could say everything turned out all right. A certain man went down from Jerusalem to Jericho and fell among thieves, which stripped him of his raiment and wounded him and departed, leaving him half dead. And by chance, there came down a certain priest that way, and when he saw him, he passed by on the other side. And likewise, a Levite, when he was at the place, came and looked on him and passed by on the other side. But a certain Samaritan, as he journeyed, came where he was, and when he saw him, he had compassion on him, and went to him and bound up his wounds, pouring oil and wine, and set him on his own beast, and brought him to an inn, and took care of him. And on the morrow, when he departed, he took out two pence, and gave them to the host, and said unto him, Take care of him, and whatsoever thou spendest more, when I come again, I will repay thee. Which now of these three thinkest thou was neighbor unto him that fell among the thieves?